Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Shane with Crystal Clear 101 with another toy review, another Transformer, and this one I'm actually really pleased with. This is the Fall of Cybertron, Cybertronian Jazz. And this is as he appeared in the Fall of Cybertron video game. He is a deluxe class, and his current retail price, when I last I checked, was fifteen forty nine. That's over at Walmart. But it's going to be roughly the $15, $18 range, depending on where you go. But um, I just love the way that they did this jazz right here. He really looks like his in-game counterpart, even right down to the head sculpt. But yeah, they captured his head sculpt very well with this figure. But other than that, um, he's got great articulation. His, his articulation includes a ball-jointed head. He has a ball hinge right at the shoulder. Um, it's a ball hinge. He has a hinge swivel right at the shoulder, and his hands are on ball joints. He has no waist movement. Now, his legs um, has similar articulation. Uh, the base of each leg is on a ball joint. Um, each knee is a hinge swivel, and each foot is actually a hinge. And they, there's some heavy clits in them that actually secure his feet rather well. Uh, let me go ahead and give a little 360 degree view of this guy. I really just like how this jazz looks overall. His overall presentation, both robot and vehicle form. I just really like how this jazz is done. And best part is, um, for a deluxe class, he's really not too terribly horrible to, tra to transform. To start, let's go ahead and remove his pistol. Now, to start, we're going to pop his arms out. Next, pop out his lower back right here. And this goes ahead and frees up a lot of him right there. This frees up like a lot of him right there. Now we're going to simply fold in his feet backwards like so. Gonna bring them together. And I'm gonna go ahead and just bring these in, fold these in. As for his arms, now right in here um, is a peg hole. Right there's the peg. We simply fold this down a little bit. Have to work with it a little bit sometimes. But we do that for both of the arms. There we go. Next, for both arms, we rotate them. And this little hinge right here goes into this little slot right here. Simply do that for both the arms. Then simply fold in both the hands. Just make sure that both the feet and both legs are actually connected. Then we have a peg hole right there and a peg right there. Simply fits them into, into position. And there we go. We have Jazz in his Cybertronian racer mode. And this just looks slick. I just like the way that this looks overall. How the blue, how the little bit of blue with the rest of it being white just makes this a very overall attractive looking Jazz. And best part is, um, he actually has three spots on for weapon storage. There's a little hole right here, so you can place his blaster here. So he has a forward mounted gun. And he also has a spot right here, and same spot on the other side. So you can actually mount his blaster on either side of his weapon mode. But, I mean, overall, this is a great deluxe, j deluxe class version of Jazz. If you like Fall of Cybertron, if you like the character Jazz in general, 
this is definitely one that's not to, to skip out on. If you can find this figure, I'd go ahead and get him. But overall, he's an absolutely dead solid deluxe class jazz. He's a, just a dead solid Transformer overall. But this is my review of the Deluxe Class Fall of Cybertron Jazz. Be sure to rate, comment, subscribe.